I was noticing this summer that my Aveo's dash clock was always resetting, especially after a heat. So this is how I fixed it. First, you pop off the cover with a flathead screwdriver. It comes off really easy. You don't need to worry about it. There's slots in there. And after you do that, you switch to a Phillips head. Just unscrew the two screws, one on each side. pull the whole unit out. It's connected by a cable in the back. Just gently kind of reach behind and pull that out. And then you've got the main unit free. Um, I looked this up. It's like $65 um, new, maybe 30 used. I'm going to show you how to fix it, or at least how I fixed it. Pry it open again with the flathead, just carefully. Um, don't make my mistake and open it um, the way so the buttons fall out. You'll see here, I had to push the buttons back in. Gently take it the rest of the way out of the case. It's just kind of held in by some plastic pins. And then once you get it out, you're going to kind of gently unfold it. It's connected by a ribbon, the two circuit boards. And look on the gold printed circuit board. You might see some discoloration from some solder that's melted. I cleaned this up with some rubbing alcohol. Just gently. Make sure you don't get any cotton fiber staying behind. And that might be enough to fix it for you, but I also noticed that the solder on these 10 points here seemed cracked and not good, so I heated them up again and put some new solder to make sure the contact points were still connected. So after you add that little bit of solder, you just fold up the circuit boards again, put it back in the casing, screw the casing back in, and you're done. That's it. Hope that helps you. Take care.